My name is Tara Flynn and I'm a sophomore at Delphi University with a sports management major and a minor in communications and marketing. My ideal profession would be coaching women's basketball at the college level and this would be ideal for me because I have a basketball background, I have a passion for the game of basketball, I love, love the game, love teaching the game, love learning the game, just want to be a coach. My strengths for filling this role are many because first, I have a lifetime of basketball background. I'm 20 years old now, I have two years of a college under my belt. I've been playing since I'm four years old and I really just love the game, want to keep learning the game. Two, if I become a coach, you know, my strength is I'm driven to make my environment better and with the help of co-coaches around me and even my own players, I'm driven you know, to make a program out of you know, my job and to really drive myself to be a successful coach. Um, another strength I have as a point guard in college basketball now, you know, I'm an average player, so I have an instinct and a knack for the game. I'm a student of the game. I could be transform those skills that I have on the court and the thoughts that I have on the court to, to a coach in situations and, and in training and in developing players, you know, on and off the court as people, which I learn from my coaches now, and also as players on the court. Um, from researching my profession, profession, I have found that women college coaches are doing better and better in this field. Um, co coaches like Pat Summit and uh, you know, big time women coaches are growing and they're getting paid more and more with the more success they have in this field. Although, you know, the, the salary might not be as high as men coaches, it's growing. Title IX has allowed this and I have researched that and as sports manager major, it would be easy to apply my degree and what I've learned you know, throughout this four years of college as a position as a head coach. Also, just being a player in college in general is plenty of experience. And as an average player and keep growing and learning the game, it would really be helpful. Um, Title IX obviously has opened doors for women to strive in this profession. And the more women's college basketball grows, the more women are going to be successful. Things that I've learned from this course that will affect my job are culture, race, and sports ethics, and they're all very effective in coaching. I learned that each player would have a different background. Obviously, if I was a coach, they would have to be treated differently depending on location, race, um, and obviously including their academics. And things, things would have to be weighed, and I learned this in class discussing um, you know, culture and race. Sports and media would be something that I would have to be an expert in also in selling myself and my program um, because if I want to be a great coach and have a successful program, these players would have to be you know, top-notch, have to be a good recruiter, and that can only happen if you know, I get myself out there and uh, promote my team and you know, be on the media, be on social media, be on Twitter, have an Instagram. These are all things that my coaches do here now that I'm learning from now. And I hope to someday apply to my job. Thank you.